Hi everyone, this is Quantum Cats. Our focus today is on Fermi America, an incoming IPO and a pure play bet on solving the AI industry's greatest existential threat, the power bottleneck. The growth of generative AI is now restricted less by silicon and more by reliable, scalable energy. Fermi is positioned as a strategic infrastructure scarcity play in the form of a real estate investment trust, or REIT. Before explaining what it does, I want to call out the financial snapshot and valuation of the company. From a traditional financial standpoint, the company is a development stage entity with zero operating revenue since its January 2025 inception. It has reported only initial costs, totaling a cumulative net loss of 6.4 million through June 30, 2025. The offering, which has been upsized, seeks to raise approximately 650 million by offering 32.5 million shares in the $18 to $22 range. At the high end, this implies a bold market capitalization of approximately $13.2 billion. This valuation is not based on near-term earnings. It is based on the strategic scarcity value of the future and the perceived high probability of successful execution. The entire investment thesis hinges on two de-risking milestones. First is political capital. The involvement of former U.S. Energy Secretary Rick Perry and the explicit political alignment of the campus name are designed to secure long-term, subsidized federal financing, specifically through the DOE Loan Programs Office. Fermi is currently in the pre-approval process, and the definitive closure of this low-cost capital is paramount. Second is customer commitment. While Fermi is in advanced discussions with foundational anchor tenants AI developers and GPU manufacturers no binding, multi-gigawatt tenancy agreements are yet secured. The execution risk is extreme. The company's S1 filing explicitly acknowledges that Fermi is a development stage company with no operating history facing execution risk across all major components. Historically, large-scale nuclear projects are subject to major cost overruns and delays, which threatens the ambitious 2032 operational target for the nuclear component. Since everything is based on storytelling, do you believe the story? Here's what it says. Fermi's unique proposition is vertical integration. This is not a standard data center REIT. Their flagship, Project Matador, the Hypergrid, is a planned 5,800-acre campus in the Texas Panhandle. The long-term vision is an unprecedented 11 gigawatts, GW, of capacity by 2038, designed to simultaneously house the next three largest data center campuses in existence. The power mix is the key differentiator. Dedicated on-site generation, including up to 11 gigawatts of natural gas, and critically, 4 gigawatts of nuclear power from four Westinghouse AP-1000 reactors. This behind-the-meter solution is intended to provide reliable 24 7 power, insulating hyperscalers from public grid instability, a massive competitive advantage. Fermi's trajectory will be defined by its ability to convert political capital into regulatory efficiency and secure long-term commercial commitments. Until the financing and tenancy risks are substantially mitigated, FRMI remains a highly speculative instrument best suited for phased entry based on confirmed milestone achievements. That's all for today's talk. Will you step in, in the comments? Leave your thoughts. Thanks for listening. This is Quantum Cats. See you next time.